Remove the power from the avalanche. Disconnect the suction line. Pull the pump tube off of the bulkhead fitting. Loosen the liquid detector cover thumb screw. Open the pump band latch and rotate the band out of the way. Pull the pump tubing out of the sampler head. Replacement tubing for models 5800, 6712, and Avalanche come in packages of pre-cut tube bundles. Install the tubing coupler into the new pump tubing on the end that is closest to the blue bands. Insert the new pump tubing into the sampler head, making sure that the blue band closest to the end of the new pump tube fits into the groove for connection to the suction line. Close the liquid detector cover. Hand tighten the thumb screw and re-secure the pump band latch. Reapply power and press the white on key to power up the avalanche. To reset the tubing counter, press the down arrow key to get other functions blinking and press enter. With maintenance selected, press enter. Use the arrow keys to select pump tube alarm and press enter. The current pump counts limit is displayed. Press enter, then select yes to reset the pump counter. Then press enter and the red stop key to finalize the reset. To test the pump operation on the new tube, press the number one button followed by enter to run the pump in the reverse direction. Press the red stop key to stop the pump. Next, press the number three button followed by enter to run the pump in the forward direction. Press the red stop key to stop the pump. After testing the pump operation, connect the suction line to the tubing coupler. Replace the pump tube on the bulkhead fitting. Pump tube replacement is now complete.